briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a notable 1951 case heard by the Oregon Supreme Court, C.E. Miller was found guilty of procuring property under false pretenses. The situation leading up to the lawsuit revolved around Miller's false claims of ownership over a tractor and the authenticity of a mortgage. In order to secure a guarantee on an obligation, the debt owed to Howard Cooper Corporation was taken on by Hub Lumber Company, deceived by Miller's presentation of ownership. The primary question in this case was whether Miller's actions fell under the purview of the statute concerning false pretenses, as this regulation, based on common law and English statute law, strictly required that the obtained object must be capable of ownership and physical possession. Miller's defense argued that he had simply obtained the privilege of a guarantee benefiting him, a right or advantage that could not be duly owned or transferred, going against the specifications of the false pretenses statute. They argued that the lower court's judgment might have been flawed if it was based on Miller receiving a thing in action from the guarantor. Sealing the fate of the case was the state's argument which was found non-applicable as they claimed that the procurement of a loan through fraudulent means was a crime under the statute. The court ruled that since the loan was obtained from another entity and not the direct victim of Miller's false pretenses, the statute was not violated. In the final verdict, the Oregon Supreme Court chose to side with the defense, stating that Miller's actions did not violate the statute and that the indictment didn't officially allege a crime. Therefore, the former judgment was reversed, leading to the dismissal of the case. The decision primarily rested on the clear distinction drawn between larceny and obtaining property by false pretenses, where physical possession of an object was more significant than securing a financial advantage. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.